Hey, have you heard from Connor? He's cheating on me. I know it. He's not cheating on you. Have you tried calling him? Calling is so aggressive. I already texted. I'll do it. I don't mind being aggressive. <laughs> That's an understatement. Hey, watch it, little bro. I'm calling him. Don't. He'll know it's because of me. So? You're his girlfriend and my best friend, and he missed his shift this morning. He's cheating. It's the only explanation for why he's been so weird lately. If he's cheating on you, I'll murder him. Besides, why would he cheat on you? You're perfect. I don't know. He's a boy. Fair point. Maybe you just need to be less available. Make him jealous with the next guy who walks in here. Hello? Anybody work here? I'm with a customer. So what do you think? Wow, remarkable service. I think we should probably go. Can I get a matcha latte? Does this look like the kind of place that serves a matcha latte? No, this looks like the kind of place that serves burnt coffee and cow's milk. Correct. Now what would you like? Forget it. What should I expect from this stupid town anyway? Have a nice day. Come back soon. <laughs> I never thought I'd say this, but you should stick with Connor. So, how does it feel being a freshman? It's great. It's way cooler having no friends in high school than having no friends in middle school. You totally have friends, Max. Like, what's that one guy's name? You mean Haruki? He was an exchange student, and he went back to Japan. Oh, well, you'll be fine. Just be yourself. All you need is one, like me. I have grace. Yeah, but you're cool. I'm not. Besides, you'd have a lot more friends if you were just a little... What? Nicer? Why? I don't put up with anything, and I'm the best employee Junior has. Everyone else, they come in, they do their shifts to appear well-rounded. You can't let people walk all over you, or else they won't stop. Easy for you to say. What is that supposed to mean? Are those jerks still messing with you? No. Because if they are, you should tell me. They're not, okay? Just leave it alone. Hey, Max. Hey, I missed you at Junior's this morning. Uh, sorry. I had another emergency football practice. I was worried. So was Vic. Right. Uh Vic was worried? She probably was just mad that I wasn't there to boss around. I'm just saying, you could have texted. I never heard back from you last night. Sorry, I, um, I was up late playing Fortnite with Jordy. So, everything was okay? You just seem kind of, I don't know, distant lately. Yeah, I, I'm fine. Just a lot on my plate right now with the homecoming game and everything. Right. Uh, speaking of homecoming, do you want to see my new sketch for the homecoming poster? Can we actually talk about this later? I'm kind of in a rush right now. What? The new kid. Look at him. God, he's so hot. He makes me want to say Auga like one of those old-timey cartoons. Are you working today? I'm gonna see if he wants to come by juniors later. Are you okay, Con? <laughs> yeah, uh, sorry, um, probably just had too much coffee. Oh, yeah. I, uh, I stayed up late studying for pre-calc with Grace. Okay, everyone, we have a new student to welcome. Nick, go ahead and introduce yourself. Uh, hi, my name's Nick. I moved here from New York City with my sisters. Uh, not really used to the small town living, but I'm trying to make the best of it. So, here's to hoping. I'm Jordy. New York's like totally my favorite city. You been? Oh, yeah. Well, no. Uh, Gossip Girl's my favorite show. So. To do. He won't even admit that anything is wrong. Maybe he just sucks and you should break up with him. Vic, kidding. Mostly. Look, all I'm saying is you're stuck in a holding spot and it's time you do something. Like what? I don't know. We could spy on him. 
Uh, but we would need disguises. <laughs> like our fourth grade Halloween costumes when he dressed up as spies. <laughs> we would need something a little more sophisticated than fake mustaches. <laughs> I don't know why I ever let you talk me into that. I better go before you talk me into something else I'm gonna regret. Can I just have my glasses? Watch it, freshman. Why do you have so much stuff in here, Miller? Pens, books, nothing good in here, huh? Can I just have my glasses? What is going on here? Oh, here comes the big scary sister. What's up, Vicky? Don't call me Vicky. We're just playing backpack pinata. Everyone gets a prize. Oh, stop! No! Let go! You're so annoying! Go, Vicky, your brother's calling. No! Go to play. You're gonna pay for that. I thought you were playing pinata. Listen, you pretentious New York Nick. The name's Nick. Stop! Run. He's gone. I think we're good. You just got in a fight with the two most dangerous kids at our school. You're welcome. I wasn't thanking you. I had it all under control. I was just trying to make up for this morning. I'm not myself without a cup of coffee. Yeah, well, I'm fine. So you could take your cocky chivalry somewhere else. I would, but I'm new around here. How about a tour? You're unbelievable. I get that a lot. And modest, too. So, for your after school? Nope. Tomorrow? I'm working. I'm always working. Come on. You can't always be at that greasy spoon. It's called Juniors. Your brother's so hot. Dude, he's my brother. So, he's also the future town mayor, which, like I said, makes him totally hot. <laughs> he's that always very own Justin Trudeau. Trudeau's a prime minister. I don't care, he's gorgeous. Did Junior say you could hang up conservative propaganda? <laughs> we hang up everything. There's a flyer there for unicycle lessons. Oh, where? What, I can learn. My brother's an independent, and you're not in charge. Does he even believe in climate change? Oh, of course he does. I think. I'm gonna show you something. I really have to finish this. A bunch of angry white men yell at each other and then they vote so quick. Vic, just look. What is this? It's our disguise. Nola Babe L6, and she, like, totally loves football players. What? How is this a disguise? I followed the whole football team and created a new account. We're gonna message Connor and see what happens. You want me to catfish my own boyfriend? That's absolutely insane. So, yes. Okay, how about ever since I saw you throw that football, you're all I dream about. Ew, too much. Okay, okay. Hey. I saw you at the football game and think you're cute. OMG, I can't be cool. You're gonna give us away. Okay. What does it say? I'm really disappointed. That's messed up. Vic? My office. Listen, kid, uh, I wanted to have a quick talk. I know what you're gonna say, but that review was not about me. Now that I've got two locations, I, I'm gonna need some help. It wasn't even a real review. I want you to be manager. Okay, it was about me, but she was a total snob and deserved it. Wait, what? I want you to manage this location. Are you dying? What's wrong? Oh, no, I'm not dying. Jeez, Vic. It's just that I have a lot on my plate and I gotta take care of some personal things. So what do you think? Sure. Listen to me, kid. I trust you more than I trust my own daughter, Nellie. But don't tell her I said that. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Listen. Hey, doctor. Listen to me, kid. I got faith in you. You can do this. Well, that is how you pull a proper espresso shot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Wow, it's so informative. Can you teach me anything else? Uh, what are you doing? Only employees are allowed back there. Here, fill that out, put those on, and Vic will show you the room. You're officially employed. I'm sorry, what? Heard it was the best place in town. Plus, I owe some kid a new iPhone. Can we talk about this? Look, give him a break, all right? You're gonna need help now that you're managing. Wait, Victoria's managing? Can we talk about this? Nothing to talk about. All right, good luck, kids. Don't burn the place down. Guess you're gonna be showing me around after. Next time on Juniors. Getting a drink to some girl isn't a good business strategy. This is amazing. I can't wait to tell everybody. Wanna come over after? Are you sure your aunt won't be there? I'm sorry I'm interrupting. <laughs>